Jerry Tipton, we'll start with you. Yeah, hi, Davian. Hey, I wondered uh, what your expectations were when you decided to transfer to Kentucky and how different has this season been than what you expected? Um, yeah, I mean, when I decided to transfer, I mean, my expectations are coming here where, you know, uh, hopefully, you know, we have uh, some like sort of a fan base like that we're able to attend games. Um, I mean, I really couldn't make many expectations because, you know, the pandemic was such, you know, we were all pretty clueless during that time. But, um, you know, I, I expect to come win games, have fun, you know, better myself and, you know, take my game to the next level. What's the experience been like? How would you characterize it? I mean, it's been um, a lot of character development. I think that, uh, you know, I've, I've learned so much and regardless of, you know, how things went on the court, like I've become such, you know, a better person, uh, matured my game a lot, uh, matured as a person. And I mean, I can't thank the staff and everyone else around. I mean, the fan base and everyone just for, you know, help helping develop me in all aspects as a player and a person. Larry Bach, we come to you next. Yeah, yeah, Dave, first of all, since you're going through senior day, does that mean you made a decision? Are you not coming back next year for sure now, or is this just kind of a, something still up in the air? Oh, yeah, I mean, um, no decisions have been made yet. I mean, absolutely not. Uh, I think that it's it's important that I go through um, this senior day. I mean, it was, it, I mean, I felt a lot of pain last year, you know, sitting out, um, with a cast on my foot during senior day at Creighton. I mean, those, those emotions I felt, I, I just didn't want to feel that again. I, th I felt it's important for me to to uh, go through it and have a little ceremony, regardless of uh, the decision. Okay, and then well, when you talked about that you think you matured as, as a person and a player, talk to me, what ways you think you have matured as a person during this year at Kentucky? Yeah, I mean, during that time last year, well, around, you know, a little bit early, so around like the winter part of the year and going into 2020, for me uh, at the beginning, it was really rough. And I felt at that time, like it was my lowest point. Like I'm like, ah, like, this is really bad. I was kind of clueless, but then I came here and, you know, you have super high expectations. And when you get, you know what I mean? When, when it's almost like you're promised, like, 20 apples and then you only get 10 like you get half what you expect in terms of like our record and, and you know like expectations we didn't fulfill those at the time I mean it's tough like you you know you it's hard for you so I mean me just going through this and figuring this out especially being challenged to be a leader and a voice during that time it was different for me because I mean honestly I didn't I didn't know what to expect coming here and um, like it, it it was it was demanded of me to, you know, be vocal and it challenged me as a person. And I feel like being someone to have to lean on during these times really, you know, made me, you know, I, I know it's crazy to sound, uh, say, but like grow up even more like quicker uh, here. So, I mean, just just being in that position has really helped me. And then, you know, um, in terms of like communicating with younger guys, that's also helped me as well. John Wong, we'll come to you next. Hey, Davion, congratulations on making it to Senior Day. You know, as part of local media, one of the things that we really enjoy is watching how guys can mature over the course of, of four years. And, and we didn't get to see the day beyond as a freshman, but what would the senior day beyond, what type of advice would the senior day beyond get the freshman day beyond? He would he would look at him and say like don't judge your today by what you know um, what tomorrow can bring like just you know just just stay grounded um, know that God is real and He has a plan for you and um, freshman Davion I mean I was so wide eyed I didn't I probably wouldn't even listen to myself uh, today but I mean it's crazy like I, I didn't expect to be in this position if I had if I had to write this story by myself I. I don't know where I'd be, so I mean, just just really tell myself to stay grounded and, and, and keep going because you don't know where it can take you. Kent Spencer, we'll come to you. Davion, you guys have now won three straight. In your mind, what's changed? 
Um, I mean, you 